Hello and welcome in, Batsies! Welcome to the Quarry Chapter 7! We are just scooting along. Um, so we left off with Laura popping back in, so I'm really hoping uh, we semi go back in time and figure out what is going on. Because I want to know what happened to Laura and Max so bad. Um, but buckle on in, everybody. Let's jump into this chapter and see what's going on. I'll see you later! The past so, behind uh, us. Why didn't you come? Oh, does that mean go Where back have you in been time? For the past two months? We did come. One night early. Ah. Uh, that was our mistake. What the heck? Time to start chapter seven. Oh. Oh, oh, this Max. Everybody covered in blue. No. We're gonna. We're just gonna be zonked. <laughs> Max sounds growly. <laughs> Ma'am, this is gonna get a little messy. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> Hello? What's happening? Oh. I mean... He did say it was gonna get messy. <laughs> he didn't lie to us. That's for sure. No, no. Okay. Oh! Hey! How does she still have makeup on? That eyeliner has got to be tough. What have you done to Max? Shut up. Oh. You can't just. Shut up! This is an okay. interrogation. I ask, you answer. Okay, damn. <clears throat> Name. Uh, see. <sighs> Laura Kearney. I feel like if we work with him, he'll give us more information. Who are you traveling with? Than and if what we're is your like angry and like, Max you're a piece of crap. Boyfriend. Just like stuff like that. Where were you headed last night? To Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp. You already know this. What have you done with Max? No. I ask, you answer. That's how this works. Okay. See, I feel like if we say angry, like, I just, I feel like, I don't, I don't think you guys can see that, but there's, like, this side, the left side is the angry one. Like, I don't know. I don't, I don't feel like it will do much. Fine. What do you want to know? Oh. Well. Uh. Why are we going to hack his quarry last he night? He wasn't expecting us to Max be compliant. Counselors. <laughs> oh, bullshit. Counselors aren't due until today. I told you, we twitchy. drove up and got there early. We <laughs> figured we'd just go to camp. Why didn't you go to the motel like I told you? Because we were, like, way closer to the camp. And we're broke. Yeah. Mm. They're, they're college kids, bruh. Or going to college? Sheriff. Okay, Sheriff. Hackett. Wait. Hackett? Like, 
Chris Hackett? Don't change the subject. Ooh, what the f*** is going on here, man? I was looking for you, so I didn't know what you was going on here. I was being compliant. Not a goddamn I swear. clue. I was you just stepped in some grade A double prime, go ahead and kill yourself cosmic type shit, young lady. Oh, dear. And your only option is to buckle the f*** up and do what I say. Do you understand? Yes, sir. Stop trying to intimidate me and tell me what the fuck is going on. Yeah, copper. Is, is Max alive? I feel like I'm going crazy. Depends on how you you do that. <laughs> what? Nope, nope, nope. I, I really just... I know everyone that's probably watching this is like, Let's why go. the hell aren't you doing the lash out and angry options, zombie? You're supposed to hey. stick up for yourself. But like, I, I feel like in the hey, long run... you! Asshole! It just, it isn't gonna like... It's not what gonna the, work what the out. What's going on? Like, I feel like it would I just know like... You hear me. Fuck something up. And I don't want to do that. I just, I really feel like if you're compliant and stuff, you get more information about what's going on, so like, you could do more with it. Max! Are you okay? Yeah. I mean, I'm... I'm kind of all mixed up, but... More or less intact, I think. He's Nike. Laura? Yeah? Why am I naked? <laughs> what? You're naked? The fuck? <laughs> I mean, after we got attacked, the next thing I know, I'm waking up in a jail cell, and you're gone, and now you're back again, and, and, and I'm super naked, and there's blood and stuff everywhere. Yeah. I mean, what the fuck <laughs> happened? I was kind of hoping you could tell me what happened. I feel like I remember bits and pieces, but none of it makes any sense. Yeah, same. I, I feel like... Were we drugged? I feel like maybe we were drugged. By a cop? Do they do that? Uh... Who does this guy think he is? Well, Sheriff of North Kill, apparently. North Kill? Yeah. Max! What? Did you even look at the map? Hackett's Quarry <laughs> in North Kill. That's the town. Oh. Max is such and a it dumb better. I gotta look at his name badge and... Such a dumbie. Ooh. Oh! Max ain't gonna be naked no more. Get dressed. What's he giving you? Not gonna be the guest of honor at Fashion Week, I'll tell you that much. Hey! Did I say you could talk to each other? Sorry, sir. We'll be quiet. We will? Max? Hey, what'd you do with my real girlfriend? <laughs> <laughs> uh, I feel like Laura would be the one to fight back, but I also feel like she's smart enough to, like... No, you know? Alright, buddy. Hands through the bars. The eyebrows tweaking out, man. I don't know. I feel like Laura would know when to fight her battles and like when not to. Uh, I don't know. Your turn. <laughs> Maybe I'm just trying to make Let's it go. up so my decision anywhere. to make right more here. sense. <laughs> Come on. Hey, hey. Yeah, let's be a good boy. Let's Get go. the fuck off. Come on. Now that you're aware, move. Be a good boy. Good boy. <laughs> hey, stop struggling. You're only making a person. Laura. <laughs> like, like, who the fuck are you? What the hell did you do to her? Shut up. Who oh, did okay. chickens? Okay. Think, Laura, think. 
There's got to be something in here you can use. Oh? Wait. Is there anything... Okay, there's nothing... Wait, what's this? What? What is this? Hello? Well, let me click this one. Oh! While the town of North Kill lay there sleeping, the hag in the woods started weeping. As the bodies decay, the wolves hunt their prey, and the sheriff continues his creeping. Oh! Can I click it? Okay. Cool. That was weird. We were over there earlier. But okay. Sis. Ooh, this, oh, it's a brick. A removable brick. Do we have a tool? Okay. Not fingies. Not a chance. Fingies some not sort of lever. The job. What else do we have in here? I'm guessing there's something that. Oh! I think there's a spoon. <gasps> spoon! <laughs> A spoon and a- yeah, we know what that was used for. That could work. But we're gonna pretend we don't. <laughs> there we yeah, go. Yeah, this ought to do it. Does it? Because it's like a weapon. And I'm guessing there's nothing in there, but I'm- Yes! Thinking we'll be able to find something later and put it in there. It's just- just a thought. Just a thought. Spoon back. I'm surprised he left the spoon in there in the first place, you know? Watch it, man. I bruise easily. Give me a break. Break. Why do you need a break, sir? Hey, the second we get out of here, you're toast, motherfucker. Okay. Sure. She just, like, went back on every second decision I made. Wait, wait, well... Answer your questions. You just can't lock us up in here with no goddamn explanation and expect us to be all butter and cupcakes, okay? Just work with us here. You have nothing to bargain with. Come on. Ah! Come on! <laughs> I feel like that was a solid, like, response, though. Hey, you can't just leave us in here! Hey! I feel like that was a solid Come back. answer. Sorry, I had to itch my nose. Itchy nose. Okay. Fuck! Yeah, that, that was... <laughs> Pinky Bucky. Pinky Bucky. <laughs> I think the next time I stub my toe, I'm gonna use that one. You're like, son of a binky bonky. How'd it go in there? You sing like a canary? Nothing to sing about. I'm sure you've got plenty to confess. <laughs> <laughs> well, that may be true, but I don't think he's too interested in how I cheated off Mikey Washington in eighth grade chem. <laughs> oh, really, cute. though? What happened? He, uh, he just asked a lot of questions. A lot of weirdly specific questions about us Ooh. and where we were going and why and how I was feeling this morning. And I don't know. Nothing I said made him seem any less annoyed. He asked how you were feeling? Yeah. Why, well, he didn't ask you? No. Huh. <laughs> no. Rude. <laughs> That's funny. Oh, another dynasty. Oh, hey, did you get a look at his name badge? You mean it's not really Detective Dick Whippet? <laughs> it's Hackett. 
Sheriff Hackett. You think he's related to Chris Hackett? Oh my god, like the Chris Hackett? Yeah. Who's the Chris Hackett? <laughs> this boy. Is camp leader does Mr. Not Hackett of Hackett's Quarry, remember? <laughs> Last night feels like a lifetime ago. The fuck does that mean, though? You know? Maybe. Were we set up? There's a lot of cussing in this episode. This freaking chip, dude. Maybe Makes it's sense, some but... kind of crazy camp counselor kidnapping ring. That's an interesting I mean, way to do business. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> It's not actually good. Well, I guess Sheriff it. Hackett's not exactly acting like a typical kidnapper, but he's not acting like a typical cop either. Well, how do you know how kidnappers act? That's also a solid question. I'm just trying to get us out of here, and I can't get us out of here until I have some clue of why the fuck we're in here. Also true. I don't know. What if we can't make sense of it? What? Well, you we have to. How then? Sometimes things just don't make sense. What then? We're just stuck in a backwater jail cell for the rest of our lives? Maybe. This isn't forever. Wait, no. No, we'll be encouraging. This isn't forever, Max. You, you can't just hold us here forever. You didn't seem too convinced of that. You gotta stay positive. You can't think like that. Why not? Might as well just accept it, right? No, what fuck the that! Hell? Think about the rest of the summer, Max. And school? I mean, I've been dreaming about becoming a vet since I was five years old. I'm not gonna let this fleabag fuckface stop me. Oh, that's so cute. First, we're gonna get the hell out of this mess and enjoy the rest of summer. And then college. I mean, if we're gonna freaking crush it at orientation, we gotta get all our classes down. Laura. Did you look at all the options, by the way? I mean, it's a lot easier for me because I just need I like the classes the uplifting that are major in veterinary sciences. Laura. You're undecided, so you have to make sure you get a really good balance of Laura. everything. Stop. Uh oh. Why? I I didn't get in. Oh. What? I got rejected from the wait list. No. Oh. Why didn't you tell me? I was embarrassed. Wait, your grades were good and you wrote a great essay? Yeah, apparently not good enough. Oh, Max. Fuck. You've been making plans, Max. What the fuck? I don't know. What do you want me to say? Oh. No, we aren't going to be sarcastic. He already feels crappy. I'm sorry, about it. Max. I this really sucks. Hey, it's not the worst thing to happen this summer. <laughs> not wrong. I'm sorry. Also, though, I feel like... I um, shouldn't have kept it from you. You know you can talk to me about anything, right? Yeah. I yeah, remember I there was a chance to, like, snoop in the beginning of the game, in the prologue. I wonder if the snooping would have shown us the letter. Okay, let's just of him focus getting on getting out of here for now. Rejected. Great, sign me up. We need to go over it from the beginning. I wonder. Like from when I we left know, home? But... Like from when we ran into the cop. So after we ran into the. Whatever we ran into? Yeah. Actually, yeah, that's when shit started getting weird. The dude acted okay. super weird when we said we almost hit an animal. You remember that? It was like he already knew or something. Yeah. That's yeah. True. That was really sketchy. What if he's not even a real cop? Well, he's got to be dirty, but... I mean, I think he's a real cop. We're in a police station. I mean, yeah, but there's like... Nobody else around. Yeah, that is concerning. Especially well, the whole hack it hack it thing. Hack it hack it. Let's just go with the idea that they're both in on it. Okay. So we're supposed to meet Chris Hackett at the camp, and instead, there's nobody there, and we get attacked by something, and then the cop shows up. Yeah. That part's all fuzzy for me. Like, I, I remember 
the steps and a smell like wet fur and a a dog collar with the name Ian on it. Ian? Ian. I don't, I don't think, think that was a dog. I don't think that attacked us. Whatever it was was big. Blood. Like person sized big. <laughs> I don't yeah, think that was a dog. It really calling. did a number on you. Like I'm surprised you're not more messed up. Like like, like I vividly remember the thing's teeth ripping into you. What is messed up about that is Laura, I don't have a scratch on me. What the heck? Hey, okay, so weird question. Do you remember before we got lost? You got lost? Well, yeah, but before that, I was all like, whoa, look at the moon. It's so big, so cool to see a full moon in the middle of the woods. And you were all like, yeah, no shit, Max, it happens once a month. <laughs> yeah, so? <laughs> right, so, you know, full moon. Yeah. What if, uh... Okay, no, stop. I'm just saying, you know, maybe there's a slight chance it was a werewolf. She's like, I'm so Are you out of shit. your- <laughs> Goddamn mind? Werewolves? Werewolves? <laughs> Seriously? What the fuck? What? 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 What's so funny? I said I said literally the oh. exact same thing. Why are we repeating words? Okay. Do you, you got anything better? I mean, like zombies, aliens, time hopping Draculas. Ryan, right? Yeah. You want answers? I've got answers. Interrupt me again. You're on your own. <laughs> I feel like that's Whatever. a pretty solid response from. Uh, Laura. Would it really be so crazy with all the shit that we've been seeing with Nick with the thing on the roof? Okay, it would really start to explain a lot of stuff. Dylan, I'm just trying to keep an open mind, okay? This is like your ghost stories. How is really this so like different Dylan. from your ghost stories? <laughs> those, are, those are just campfire stories. Like, there has to be a rational explanation for everything, for all of this. There isn't. I mean, I, I'm sure there is, but there, okay, you were not still werewolves. talking so rational when you separated my hand from the rest of my body. You told me to. And if it's bite with which you're faced, cleave limb from torso with great haste. What? You did the right thing. See? She got a whole poem about it. <laughs> also, her arm kind of looks fucked up. I'm just saying. There's more to all this than you think. Oh. I think just let yep, me finish. She showed her you can decide for yourself if you believe me or not. I don't care. But I think you should hear all of it. Yes, ma'am. Ma'am, yes, yeah, ma'am. Sorry. <laughs> the next few weeks were long. The cop kept us fed and let us take showers, but aside from that, we barely saw him. Max and I, we talked a lot. Just came forward. As much as we could about what happened that night. It was like trading conspiracy theories. Oh, probably the other cell. We talked about the cop, There's the cell camp, between those two. the accident, the woods, the thing in the basement, what happened to Max. We just kept going over it all again and again, and nothing was making sense. All we knew is that we needed to get out of there. she get her hat back? Oh, I thought she was wearing her hat. Never mind. I can't take this anymore. It's not that bad. They're probably in the same crap at camp. No, I can't take being in here anymore. Oh. Yeah, yeah well, that part's pretty tough. We've got to do something. We've got to get out of here. We need a, p a plan. We well, keep saying that. But it's been weeks, so, you know, let me know if you have one. That's really not very helpful, Max. You are forgetting something. What? Just the ETBT tiny detail that I may or may not be a fucking werewolf, you Laura. Just keep it down. So what? What can we do, really? We run off into the sunset only to be stopped when ah. I turn into a nasty ass monster ah, and kill you and eat you, and then I run off alone into the sunset with little. Bits of you stuck in my teeth? Okay, okay, stop. Just one problem at a time. All right, we, we don't even know if that's what's really going on, and we won't until we get the hell out of here. Okay. 
Well, it seems to me that we only have two real options. We can play nice and try to get this guy on our side. What, so he'll let us go? Or... We try to catch him off guard and make our escape. We gotta escape. What if we get on his okay, good side? Okay, so... Let's yeah. say we get on his good side. What then? Brunch and mimosas every Sunday till he sees the error of his ways? Yeah, I was being rhetorical. <laughs> the dude doesn't have a good side to get on. I mean, he don't even talk to us half the time. I don't know. I think we could crack him. Laura, I think he's just biding his time until he can figure out a way to get rid of us. Permanently. I think we should try. I mean, if he was gonna kill us, we'd be dead by now. So also what's he true. waiting for? Also true. Look, we just... If this doesn't work... We try to escape. Deal? Yeah. Deal. So, all right, how are we supposed to get this guy to like us if he won't even talk to us? I don't know. I mean, he's gotta have a weak spot, like something we can use. It's not like we don't have time to figure it out. <clears throat> yeah. Okay. Hey, hey! T-Money! Can I call you T-Money? <laughs> like, why is that what why? he goes for? You can call me Officer Hackett. T-Money? Like, why? Hackett? Like, as in Hackett's quarry? What's it to you? He's gonna know. Just interested is all? Like, he's gonna know. I feel like know. we hardly know you. Well, let's keep it that way. Okay. Oh, come on, Team Money. Lighten up, man. No reason we can't be buds, right? I can think of seven. Seven? I want to know what the seven are. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna do understanding, but he's gonna he's gonna know. He's gonna know. You're right. That... We've been just awful, and we we're really just being make ridiculous. He's gonna know. Oh. He's gonna know. I see what you're doing. Well, it's not gonna work. See, he knows. You think we're just gonna be besties, and I'm gonna let you walk right out of here. Not gonna happen. Asshole! Max! Max was sincere. You know what's sincere. going on? Laura was. Laura was. We know Max is a werewolf! Oh. Full moon's in a few days, right? What, what then? No, ma'am. You don't know the half of it. Oh. Oh. Then freaking tell us. Bruh. This is a doo doo. I said, take your fucking clothes off. Fuck off. Get Ooh. back. Max, Max what's going up. on? <laughs> Get the fuck away from him. Ooh, yeah. Max is not look good at all. Uh oh. Come here. Off of me. This yeah. isn't gonna go well. This isn't gonna go well. Have a seat. Sir! Ah! Quit squirming. Said you wanna be a vet, right? Call us an internship. Let me go! You're not gonna believe it until you see it for yourself. See, but if Max is a werewolf. Fucking ask next time then, dude. Jeez. Don't get too close. Like. Do, do you see how close she is to the, like, gate, though? Mm-hmm. Just wrapping things up like, here. I have a feeling... No, we're not going to call for help. It's not going to do anything. I feel like it would just cause more Down issues. Down to 20. Over. What's going to happen? Well, I'll tell you. I feel like you should have put us farther pretty. away. I have a bad feeling Don't worry. This. I'll be back at dawn. Because, I mean, Laura is missing You're really going to leave me here? You'll be fine. So... Just don't get too close. Push mark. Yeah, well... It's not like I can go farther away, either. Ooh. Scary. Spooky, scary skeletons. 
Tigger's down your spine. He's definitely gonna turn into the thing. Max, tell me exactly what you're feeling. Laura, I... I don't feel so good. Not good? Like how? I don't know, just... Bad. Mm. Come closer, let me see your eyes. I think I better stay back. Max, I need to observe you. Oh, I made a mistake. Is this fucking close enough for you, bitch? Whoa, he got angry as hell. He also had yellow eyes, not his usual colors. Ouch. Max? E he looks like Max? swollen. Tell me what's going on. <laughs> I, uh, I think Max has left the building. Max! Yeah, I don't think he's still. Oh no, dear. Yeah, no, Max is gone. and everything that's up. Ooh. So much for depth perception. Okay, so we're just chilling. Yeah, let's go explore. Let's see what that bastard cop's hiding. Yeah, let's go. Yeah, we're not going over there. Max can suck it. Okay, this is where we were, right? Bathroom? Yeah. Okay. I'm guessing, like, we've taken showers and stuff before. In there. Just, just a guess. Uh, oh, hey! Found another card! Let's go. The chariot. What's this? Okay, that's locked. Can't go there. What's he hiding? I don't know. All I know is that's not the way to go. I'm guessing that's the way out. What's this? Okay, those, I feel like the big doors are... Oh, it doesn't even give me the option for that one. I think that's a, yeah, that's a door to the outside. We don't want to go outside. We're not leaving Max. And there is three. Okay. Ugh. Yeah. I'm gonna need to rest soon. Yeah, well, we're going to investigate things first, okay? Mama's boy. Fifty six. That means he was born in nineteen sixty five. How does that? I don't know how that is relevant, but okay. Okay. Do we guys see anything else in here? Nah, I don't think that chair is gonna let us pass, anyways. Plus, her saying the thing about the resting soon, I want to make sure that we get through all of these rooms. Ooh, a 
just it? Whoever was wearing this cap be doing too well. Chard cheese fish? Oh, the free show player. Oh. Oh, there's this. Okay. We got that. Okay. Oh. Keely said, however happy the ones were to go. Oh. Trail camera. Box of matches. Why is this weird? It's like there, but it's not. Interesante. Uh, I don't think I see anything else in here. There's a jump rope. We can do uh, jump rope stuff. Nah. Oh, I can go faster. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Ooh! We can put that in our hidey hole! In our thing! This must be what he used to knock me out. Ooh, are we gonna use it to knock I can hide this in my cell. I need to lie down. Okay, let's go back. Why does it look like it's smoky? Oh, it's raining outside? Well, I guess also in... With the other campers, it's also raining, right? Okay. Yeah. I don't... Because I know she'll probably won't leave without Max, so... Let's put that stuff in our hidey hole. The whole time. Uh, we don't want him to see that. At least still one. Yeah, I feel like he would notice, like, because there'd be one less tranquilizer, like, drug, but. Who knows? <laughs> Maybe we should sleep now. Uh, go to sleep. I feel like we found everything we have found. And plus, she's zonked. She took meds and stuff. <sighs> you want to tell me what happened? <gasps> it's covered in blood. I could ask you the same thing. Why didn't you run? Not leaving Max. You can't leave him. No. Almost. I won't leave Max. This doesn't mean I trust you. I don't care. I just want to help him. Turn around, hands against the wall. Seriously? I am too tired to argue. But. Ugh. Me too. Well, it's a good thing I made sure to put the stuff in the hidey hole, because otherwise I think you may have found it. Happy? I'll brew some coffee. Coffee, coffee, coffee. Oh, I thought she was going to follow. What's this? Oh, he's gonna show An Max education. what he did to me. Or did the Lord, not me. But You know what I meant. Okay. Nice job cleaning up. The eye. I mean. Thank you. Question mark? 
It's harder than they make out in the textbooks. Especially when nobody's helping you. You're the doctor. Uh, animal doctor. And no, I'm not. And I probably never will be. Stuck in here forever. You know, just because you know, doesn't mean you know. You know? Uh... What? I'm not. This isn't what it seems to be. You're gonna have to be more specific. You and Max are in just as much trouble as I am. Oh. My family? We didn't mean to hurt anybody. Mm. We're just trying to survive like everybody else. Do you understand? Do I understand? Not really. We're gonna end this thing once and for all. We? Yeah. I don't feel like he'll talk about his family. Okay. Fine, let's end it. Let Max and I go and we'll find someone who can help. Eh, that's not how he meant that. Not what I had in mind. You're seriously asking for my help? I don't want you to help me. You're gonna do this for Max, and I'm gonna get what I need. Let's see how smart you really are. What is this? Information. Well, what does it mean? Read it. When full the moon above shines first, the beast internal shall outward burst. One by one leads lambs to slaughter. It stalks your breath, but shuns clear water. And should you yourself be cursed, armed with silver, and the first, when moon is full before its wane, rend the beast that cursed you slain. No longer shall you face your blight or fear the dread of full moon's light. Yeah. No. Keep reading. Nope, 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 nope. I feel like taking his gun and if it's a problems. bite with which you're faced, cleave limb from torso with great haste. Perchance you'll save your cursed soul before infection takes its toll. Starting to get the picture. It's not a lot to go on. And frankly, it's shit. Why did they have to make it rhyme? I don't know. <laughs> That's all we have to go on. Kill the werewolf that bit you, and you'll be cured. It has to be silver, has to be full moon. Seems pretty straightforward to me. If you can kill the werewolf, and that's a big if. If. I just want to cure Max. Mm -hmm. It's not as straightforward as you think. So wait, if Max got me in the eye, doesn't that mean I'm infected now too? No. Scratches don't do it. Only bites. Ooh. Are you sure about that? Pretty sure. So what's the plan? Well, that's from hoping you'll come in. Me? Yeah. Because your studies. I haven't 
fully started I haven't even studies, started. Honey. Well, you're the best option I got. I've been hunting this damn white wolf under the full moon so long I start to think it doesn't exist, you know? Maybe it doesn't matter because maybe there's another way. Whatever you believe, there's got to be some science. And you do science. Yeah. Look, take some time to think about all this. I'll be back in the morning. Oh, do you Seen enough? I don't think I'd believe a word he just said if I hadn't seen that. Yeah, if you just watched I hadn't seen that. rip Laura's eye out. I believe him. You can't tell me you really trust that guy now. I didn't say that. I said I believe him about the werewolf stuff, not the science bit. I don't know what he wants. He's a dirty line kidnapping cop, Laura. We should be careful of anything that fucker says. Yeah, but I mean, like, the werewolf stuff is true. Well, fuck him. He's had his chance to fix this. We're getting out of here and we're gonna fix it on our own. Hey, Laura? Yeah? I saw what happened. Mm. What I did to your eye? Oh, Max. Yeah. Is it bad? Yeah, it's pretty bad. I'm so sorry. Oh. Yeah, empathetic. I'm not gonna be resigned. It wasn't you. I know it wasn't you. I know. But it was. Oh. We're gonna fix you, Max. Promise. I promise. You said let me in there. Chris! I know they're in there. Who? The townsfolk. Go up. How'd you find out? Bobby told me. Said you scrapped an abandoned car. Oh, a while pretty... back I, I worked out the rest. Shit. Why? Well, why'd you think, Chris? Jesus, Travis. You still here? That's fucked up. Fucking bit one of them, Chris. What am I supposed to do? <sighs> what was that? Cut the cup. Let's go. You shot me. I'm telling Mom. Thank you, lucky stars. Wasn't silver. What's your plan? Can't keep him here forever. I am handling it. Maybe if you'd done your job, they wouldn't been at the camp that night. You ever think of that? Mm. If I'd have done my job, you'd all be in prison. You ever think of that? That was all Bobby and Caleb. Are those know hikers? It. That that. Journalist. Damn it, Travis. What are we gonna do now? Whatever happened to we're all in this together? <laughs> Sorry. Let's go to my oh office. My goodness. We shouldn't talk here. Max! Uh. Max! Uh. What is it? Travis was just in the hall talking, the cop. So? But Chris Hackett. Was he here to let us out? No. He's the werewolf, Max. Chris Hackett is the one that bit you down on the storm shelter. Holy okay. shit, that's... Who would have guessed? 
I mean, I guess thinking about it, I could have. <laughs> and yet you didn't. And yet you it didn't. all makes sense. <laughs> That's why Chris's car was at the lodge oh, that no. night. Travis was protecting him. That's why he followed us, and that's why he didn't kill the werewolf in the storm shelter because it was his fucking brother. God, it's so obvious. If, if Chris was the one that bit me, then. Yeah, then that's our cure. That's how we fix you. Jesus, Laura, are we thinking the same thing? Tomorrow, we're getting out of here. I'm gonna get Travis's gun. Nope. And kill Chris Hackett. Oh, well. I mean, technically... Hey! No. Hey! Help her! Laura needs help! Uh. Laura? Uh. Laura, are you okay? God damn it. What the hell is going on? Laura! <laughs> We're knocking him out, don't worry. You got this. <laughs> and he's out. <laughs> Take the keys, leave his gun. Don't take his gun. Don't take it. Or did she take- oh, she did take it. How does he get out though? That's my question. I'm starting to think you were really sick. Well, maybe I should consider acting as my major. I wouldn't go that far. She could be a pirate! We should go before he wakes yeah. up. Look at him in his overalls. That has to be so uncomfy. Why is he just standing? We should grab our stuff. We need silver ammo. He must have some around here. Got it, right? What is it? I thought I heard someone. Someone that was like you. No, I, I still can. That's that old lady's voice. It's coming from behind that door. They didn't listen to us. It is so voice. Feeling the old lady is like way more in like part of the story, and not just the quote unquote curator. There's nobody in here. What the fuck? He makes them. What is it? Shotgun shells. He loads them with silver. That's where he was last month hunting. For silver? I'm just kidding. For the way Well, I guess I won't be needing this anymore. Hey, I just realized something. We're free. Eh, we'll do reassuring. We'll be good. Hell yeah, we are. That's two months we'll never get back, but for now, we're one step closer to going home. Yay. And when is that? Tonight. Going to Hackett's quarry, and we're killing Chris Hackett. I'm guessing you have to get them while they're in werewolf form for it to count? Or can you just kill them there? I wonder how that works. 
Mm. Oops, said everything today. Is it? And I made my way here. Oh, to camp. Left Max at the island. Left Max at the island. Oh. Seemed like the best place for him, surrounded by water and all. Water and all. Oh. That's it. That's the story. Don't all jump in at the same time. Wait. The island? Like like our island? Like the one in the lake? Yeah, why? Because Jacob, he went back there looking for Emma and he hasn't come back yet. Neither of them has. Oh, shit. Well, if they were there, they're not there now. What's that supposed to mean? Don't make me spell it out for you. I've just come back from there and there's one werewolf and no people. Oh, fuck. All I know is I have to do this. I have to kill Chris Hackett before it's too late. Mm, I feel like there's another option here. After you saw me at the pool, after I shot Chris, um, I went back to the island expecting Max to be back to normal. If still werewolf. Werewolf Max. Okay. Oof. Loads in there now I just roof. Uh I have a feeling she got bit by Max. Cause her, I think it's technically her left arm, like looks really beat up. Uh, in the current time, like the present time. Max? Someone looks so beady. Max, but it's not gonna be the way you want to find Max. Max? <gasps> Hello? Ow. Got nibbled on though. So the werewolf I killed can't have been Chris. That wasn't a werewolf. It was Kaylee Hackett, Chris's daughter. Whatever I shot, that was no girl. Unless I, I guess it turned back after I shot it when I went to the island. Wait. So how come Max didn't kill you? Then? He tried. I got away. I need to end this. We don't have much time. Dun, 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 dun. So wait, is that the end of the chapter? Oh.
Smell good, don't I? Go on, take a bow. Go on. Oh. oh. Dumb fucking animal. Blech. I mean, not really, but you could get some, probably. Please, just let me go, please. I'm so sorry. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> Choke slam. That's too, Bobby. At least he's not me. Hey! Hey! Hey, where are you going? Hey! Hey! Oh, fuck. oh shit. I think that's Nick. Yeah, that's gotta be Nick. Baby, I need some time alone to be by myself. By myself. Mm, careful what you wear. Oh yeah, that's Nick. He's got the ripped shirt and stuff on him. Careful what you wish for. Oh, I guess it could be uh, Kaylee's brother or whatever too. I don't think they would put him in that kind of the cage. I don't think the family would like taunt him like, "Hey, take a bite." So I, I think I think that's Nick. I think it's Nick. Oh. Hello, hello. It's always nice to see you. Isn't it fun delving into the past? They're a bad lot, aren't they? Mm. Shall we have a look at what you found? I still don't feel like we know enough. The chariot. The chariot. At the reins of a chariot, we would all feel safer. Taking control, relying on determination to make our choices. Valiant. But in some cases, foolish. Many seek refuge in chariots. But perhaps in some cases, they're not as safe as we think they are. Ah, the world. <laughs> Often travelers' paths are direct, but sometimes it is not so simple. Sometimes they're intertwined with others. Compassion over anger. You will need friends where you're going. It's not until we fall into the belly of the beast that we realize how perilous things can be. And the same question as always. Will you let yes, me show yes, you more? I will. Uh, yes. Chariot or world? Only one future can be seen. Choose. So demanding. Um. The chariot looks cooler. We'll do chariot. And plus, it's being pulled by two wolves. So like. Oh. oh You'll be seeing van. me a few more times before the night's over. I look forward to that. As but, but long as Emma, you Emma is in there. Follow the right path, of course. Okay, lady. I'm so thankful we got more history. 
Uh, we found more about what happened with Lauren and Nick. Uh, also, you guys, I know, I think looking back, I was having headset troubles. So if it looks like I was talking and there's no sound, it was my headset. I apologize, but I think mostly it didn't, it didn't interfere that much with the recording. And I know you guys are mostly here for the game, so... I'm <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> um, but seriously, I'm really happy we got the backstory with Laura and Max. It's in craziness. Some crazy words. Either way, it's crazy. Uh, but we end up knowing, I think, I think that's Nick in the cage across from Jacob. So I think we know where Nick and Jacob are. Uh, so right now they're safe behind electri electrified fencing. <laughs> Uh, from, I believe those are the Hackets. I think it's the Hackets, just with everything going on. Um, but yeah, I cannot wait until next week for chapter 8. Uh, so I will see you then, Betsies. Until then, please remember to like, subscribe, and comment. But I'll see ya. Bye!